Frenchie, Haley has been on a quest this season to throw out a first pitch at all 30 ballparks, and today, here at Angel Stadium, marks number 30. Now, when I was speaking with her mom, she said this all started when Haley was five years old, and she threw out the first pitch for UNLV, the place that actually makes her 3D hands. At the time, her older brother was playing Little League for the Orioles, and she asked her mom if she could throw out the first pitch for the big Orioles. So her mom wrote a letter. The Orioles said yes. She threw out the first pitch. The next year, she met Bryce Harper. He helped her get it at the Nationals, and then after that, it was known she wanted to do it at every ballpark. Every franchise jumped on board to help her throw out the first pitch. And today, as I said, here at the Big A, marks number 30, and it has already been such an incredible and special day for Haley. She got to meet Jim Abbott before the game, who, who gave her some pointers, signed her 3D hand, as you saw there. And after that, she got to go down to the clubhouse. She got to meet Mike Sosha. And then after Mike Sosha, she actually fell to the ground when she found out she was about to meet her favorite player, Mike Trout. She was freaking out about that. It was so special for her. But talking to her mom, Jan, she said the most incredible part of this whole experience has been to see Haley's confidence grow from when she started this journey at five years old to now eight years old. She is just so, so confident and, and so willing to do whatever it takes. And here you see a special gift from Major League Baseball. They, they made her a bat with all 30 teams actually engraved on it. And right now she, she's getting ready to go out and, and throw out the first pitch. But, you know, this is really what it's all about and makes you realize when it's bigger than just the game. It's more than just the game, Frenchie, because she's gotten to, to make a wish come true, a dream come true, and inspire so many young kids out there who, who might be in her same position to know that if you have a dream and you have a wish, if you put it out there, you can make it happen. Yeah, Alex, uh, just a fantastic inspiration as we've been talking about. Um, she was born with what's called Poland syndrome, missing three fingers on her right hand, and and certainly she's had this dream. And and I can't imagine she's got family and friends and fans a across the country. I mean, I think her Twitter account is, has thousands and thousands of followers. I mean, can you sense the excitement of her completing this jersey journey here this afternoon? Oh yeah, I mean, she's still eight years old, so it, it's hard to to really fathom how she can take it all in. But she. Like I said, she is so confident. She has been dancing the entire day, putting on a show for everybody here. And you can just tell she feels at home at all of these ballparks. And she was so excited to come here to Angel Stadium. She was actually here last year when the Orioles were in town. And that's when I first got to meet Haley. And that's when she became a big fan of Mike Trout. She was a big fan of Mark Trumbo, obviously, who used to be an Angel and is on the Orioles because that was the first place she got to throw out the first pitch. But her whole family, there's, uh, I think they said about 35 to 40 people here today all supporting Haley and her journey to 30 so it has just been such a fun family event fans have jumped on board everybody is is here to, to be a part of her story and to really witness history of her throwing out the first pitch at all 30 ballparks yeah Alex uh, certainly a uh, great stuff we look forward to the first pitch here this afternoon thank you so much for that report and Jose uh, Haley sent you a tweet as well yeah you know what I'm not 24 7 on Twitter but I do enjoy just listening and hearing from the fans good or bad with the angels doing good things or bad things but overall this one really caught my attention because I see a follow by Haley's hand and I look at it I look at the uh, profile and I go that's Haley she's coming yes. to the ballpark so next thing you know I'll do a follow on her and she asked me are you gonna be at the ballpark tomorrow I'm like absolutely but you're gonna be there and to me that's even more important so I love to go and say hello to her I walked by the whole crowd today she was quite busy talking to Mike Trout but uh, those are special things to consider too that you know beyond the right hand and credit to UNLV and what they did and getting this prosthetic done for a very low cost well she was also born without a right pectoral muscle which makes it more challenging for her and for the family but certainly that's my own that attitude a huh, little swagger. I, I love it. Haley, keep it up. I look forward to seeing you soon. Absolutely infectious. Going to take our final time.